you know, we thought, why not talk a little bit about art? Because art mm. means different things to different people. Yeah. Uh, it can be a sketch from your kindergarten uh, student child. Mm. It can be something that you collected on vacation. So Stacy, we have a picture from you. And this is your favorite piece? It is. It's a really rustic piece on reclaimed barn board. And it's just a big moose. Yeah. I think it's so cute. Yeah, it's very Canada, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's kind of iconic for the cottage. It's great. Yeah. It is. Yeah. Okay, now I love uh, what you brought us, Kimberly. So <laughs> this might not be everyone's idea of art, These but I like the fact that you put them on I the wall. These are shoes I bought in Nashville, and um, it's down <laughs> It's on one, and I think Elvis is on the other one, and I, the Virgin Mary is on the third one, and I, I all have, big names. And my husband's like. What is wrong with you? And I'm like, I, I have to have them. And I brought them home and I hung them on the wall. And I just think they're so hysterical. Cute. So I like the idea that art doesn't have to be so precious. It doesn't have to, because it can be intimidating. You hear the word art gallery, you go, oh. So yeah. I'll pretty much frame anything I get my hands on yeah. and you know, Good. try it out. Why not? I think the whole point of art is to have an emotional reaction to it. Yeah, exactly. Sure. If it makes That's you laugh, point. like I don't want a sofa that makes me laugh. It's too expensive. <laughs> right? It's too expensive and it's too hard. Hard to change, but right. something kitschy in the room, I think, is fun. I yeah, think absolutely. It's really fun. So we got a bunch of uh, pics from our viewers. City Line viewer Tanya Colonna from Richmond Hill, Ontario, sent us oh, this picture. Look at this—a beautiful, beautiful painting created by her very talented brother-in-law, Vince Mancuso. So that is a portrait wow, of Tanya beautiful. from 15 years ago. Wow. I think that's beautiful. Yeah, we have another one as well. Patricia Colosimo sent us this photo of a painting by her husband James. So before wow. they were married. Patricia and James had a long distance relationship. He gave her the painting when he moved from Thunder Bay, Ontario to be with her in Toronto. Aww. And they've been married for 23 years now and they have two great sons. So that is a piece That's of art that sweet. definitely has an emotional connection. Something I learned too, when you buy a piece of art on a trip or a, a there's some sentiment attached to the piece of art. Yeah. Everybody should sign the back and put the date and describe the occasion because one day, if you're not here, your children will inherit it and they're going to know how special that was that to you in your smart. life. Isn't that a nice yeah. idea? That is so a we great tried to idea. write. We were in Nashville. We found these shoes. Like we write yeah. a little story. Write it on the back, though. Yeah. Write it on the back. <laughs> and write it on the front. <laughs> and Marla Ratner from Toronto uh, bought herself this print of Manhattan. She went to New York City for her 40th birthday and. Get the, got the print framed, so once again, a story. Awesome. My favorite piece of art is in my kitchen, and it's because my sink does not face a window. So we were looking for something that was going to be sort of lighthearted but happy. Nice. And that reminds me of the sun. Every day, no matter how bleak it is in the middle of winter, that's what I look at as I'm watching a big mountain of dishes every <laughs> night. It makes me happy, and that's a Canadian uh, artist. Her name is Meredith Bingham, and she says, some people say a perfect circle is the shape of heaven. I love that. And I love that too. That's it makes me beautiful. happy. Yeah. So as you know, we always love your input. So join the conversation every week on Twitter at CityLineCA and at TracyCityLine. Go to our Facebook page as often as you want. And of course, our website that is CityLine.ca. Let's go to break. It's home day. More coming up. <laughs>